Hello there. Today we are going to try out the streaming of a Steam game using the HP Stream 7. and uh, Or actually any tablet for that matter. We'll just uh, see how it will uh, it'll play if there's any lag. Um, so this is the Steam client running on the Stream 7 right here. On my desktop PC in the other room, I've also got it running. So as you can see, when we get one of these these games that not all of them are installed, by the way, but um, one that is installed, you can see you ha do have the option of streaming it here. So maybe we'll just pop in and out of uh, a couple games, see how well this works. And what I want to do is, okay, it's a 1080p video signal, um, and uh, we will see how this plays. So I'm interested in lag. You know, am I going to have to put things down to 720p or 1080p? Um, how well will I, I be able to play this? Now, I know what you're saying. You're not going to be able to see 1080p on a uh, screen that has a resolution of 1280 by 800, but um, this is just for um, uh, example sake. So right off the bat, um, I can feel that there's a touch of lag, but it's almost instantaneous. You know, it's 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 ever so faint, um, but it really I'm I'm kind of impressed. It it feels a lot better than I thought it would. Here's a nice bright outdoor environment. Kind of the nice thing is too, I'm not seeing many artifacting, which is you know when it uh, you get those blocky edges, you get. Uh, I'm not sure how this is going to come through with compression after I I save it as a video file, um, but live, there's there's nothing. This is just zipping around, and uh, I'm not seeing any any decompression artifacts. So that's uh, that's pretty impressive. So, yeah, before I die here, let's just get out of here. All right, so let's exit a game. Let's go to another one. Um, that was uh, that was pretty impressive. It's pretty qu pretty quick to uh, jump in between the games. I know this is another Fallout thing, I'm just using it as an example. Now, of course, this will only stream games that have been authenticated through Steam. Um, this, uh, this actually feels a little bit uh, more responsive than Fallout 3 did. I don't know why that is. I'll have to check the video settings once we pop out here. Um, See if it's 720p or 1080. Everything feels uh, feels quite good. I gotta say, this does work quite well. All right, uh, let's just do maybe one more. And uh, let's just try Half-Life. Now, I, I know the last time I did this, I think I changed it to 720p just because I was recording uh, video directly and I wanted to keep the file low. So I gotta say I'm uh, 
feeling pretty good about this. Ah, you rec probably recognize this this bit. Oh yeah, this is uh, this is really slick. So it does feel um, it does feel quite good. Anyways, this you know what? Um, unfortunately, there's a bit of delay between the recording device and the Stream 7. Uh, I'm just noticing that on the screen now of the uh, tablet I'm recording with. So the mouse clicks, and that might not seem uh, in, in time with what you're seeing on the recorded video. I'm not sure how it'll come across, but um, it is. This is uh, this is really slick. So, anyways, you know what? I'll get out of here. That's uh, that's enough of that. Um, oh, I should have canceled. There we go. So, all in all, streaming using uh, the Steam client on the Stream 7 and uh, the Steam client loaded on the desktop PC seems to be uh very slick and uh i'm i'm kind of surprised it comes out clear 1080p video streams very nicely with very very little noticeable lag um and uh yeah so anyways with that i'll close this off thanks for watching i i hope that uh maybe makes you uh feel a little bit more uh, comfortable with using this as a streaming device rather than actually gaming on it per se um but it, uh, it worked well. All right, once again, thank you for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe, or leave a nasty comment below, and uh, we'll see you soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.